Good evening, wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. We're plenty looking forward to seeing this, a capacity crowd here. Oh, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. And we're underway. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Bernardo Silva. He's a real box of tricks, Peter, with a, a super first touch and a really nice, silky smooth dribbling style. He's also got an eye for a telling pass, and... He's a more than decent finisher too. What we don't usually comment on is his phenomenal work rate and that will be a standout for this team over the course, I can assure you. Yeah, he'll be looking for a goal or two. Tries to stroke it through. That's a corner kick. better and he knows it uh, that's a little unfortunate he had a lot of people worried then Lozano, Lozano going full tilt down the left. Well, the crowd clearly like what they just saw, some real no-nonsense defending. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Takes it over to the other flank. Lozano. Mario Ruiz. Anything noteworthy in the early part of the match, Jim? Well, I think both teams probably feel it's, it's too early for either to start taking real risks. So they're still very much in a phase of, of testing the waters and, and sizing each other up. Napoli are seeing more of the ball, but still aren't carrying much goal threat. Forward tracking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. You have to admire a commitment like that, because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing, but instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Uh, the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Back to the keeper and try something new. Ruben Diaz. Manchester have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Lozano. Gets away from his opponent. Tries to cross. Gundogan. Uh, 
Rodri plays it forward. Kyle Walker. Gundogan tries to get it forward quickly. He's gone for goal! Oh, that was no routine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Zielinski. Mario Rui. Lozano. And it's got through. Gets the pillar of his man. Walker with the clearance. Lozano is on to it and can take it up. Politano. And he's there to cut it out. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Grealish. And it's Ake. Schwan. Zielinski. Lozano pulls out on the left now. What an adventurous run from a defender. Ederson claims it. And the whistle goes for half time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. The first half compared with your expectation. Yeah, and despite the scoreline, it's clear who the better side is when it comes to chances. If this is the trend that's going to continue, then there's only going to be one winner here, and uh, I don't think it's going to take too much improvement for it to happen. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. Just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped. Lots of effort, but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone can step up and produce something a little more magical. No messing about, just bludgeoned the way. And it's De Bruyne. And here's Grealish. Bernardo Silva. Gundogan. Out to the left it goes. He's got... He's gone for it! You can get that clear. Bernardo Silva. Big chance! And it's a goal! Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Now, that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Napoli have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. It's going to be a double change then. Manchester take the lead, 
Surprise, surprise. He just keeps on delivering, and listen, we all expect that. Grealish. He's got options out wide. That is an adventurous run down the left-hand side. That's good distance on it. De Bruyne. Held by a goal, needing to go up a gear. That's how it looks here. Tries to switch the play. Look at the defender bombing forward. Well, defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Gundogan. Grealish gets it out to the wing. And it's Grealish. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Defender's on the back foot. Rodri battles to win it back. Gundogan. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Napoli are not doing enough to... Grealish! And he's there to make a great save. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Time and again, they are repelled. Laporte. And it's played forward. Bernardo Silva, Grealish, oh, it's Grealish. He's got it on the right now, what's on? Well, the moans and groans from the stands now are very audible. Deftly done. Oh, the pressure is relentless, it's a very, very high press. Yeah, because it's all about winning the ball back at the earliest opportunity, a trigger by one player for the others to follow, and designed to force opposition mistakes. Zielinski. Danger averted for now. Napoli are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Going through. Rodri can hoist it clear. Napoli get it back again. Hoists it high. Ruben Diaz knocks it away. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Looks to clip it forward. And he's there to hoof it away. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. Has a hit! He's missed, but by that far... Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Manchester certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further. Hits one! Manchester can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. That intervention was very necessary. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. One goal settled it, a tense and exciting game that just got away. Look, I think a draw might have been a much fairer result today. It's just that one crucial second-half goal, that's what cost them. Well, that's it for tonight's match, so it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me and to wish you all a very good evening.